looking like we ain't the ones, man. Talk is cheap. It's a sweet. It's Madden NFL 24 on EA Sports, and we've got the latest chapter of a historic rivalry. It's the Packers and the Bears. All that and more coming up next. EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to one of our favorite spots, Venerable Soldier Field in Chicago. Today we kick off the new year with an NFC North matchup. As it will be the Green Bay Packers taking on the Chicago Bears. So now this offense will take over and they will have the football at their own 20-yard line. Now the NFL's lead rusher a season ago, Josh Jacobs. And this will be a Packers first down as he gets this up past the 30 to the 32. He used the word relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. In this case, it really fits, doesn't it? How about his ability to break tackles and his feet never stop moving? On first down, they go with Jacobs again. Well, now, after all of this, hang on here because he appears to be shaken up. Well, just the last thing you want to see here in the first quarter of a new season. Hopefully nothing serious. We'll step aside for a moment. Here's second and five now from the 37. Just shy of midfield, they'll spot it at the 49. It's a gain of 12, and the Packers have the first. How best to describe that one? I'd say right down Broadway on that run. A straight ahead running. I think that that might be something we see a lot of between the tackles today. Well, he's enjoying things so far here this afternoon. Sees a crease, and we're still for a solid game. Oh, his first throw of the season is intercepted. Picked by Kevin Byer, and a return across midfield. And the 40. And we drop you into the start of this next possession. The score, 7 0. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. And he'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. A big play that time on the catch and run. And it'll move the chains. So into Bear territory now. This is first and 10 at the 47. They go bootleg. Love rolling to his right. That's going to be caught downfield by Reed. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. The 26 big yards on that one. It's another first down. And that's how you shake off the interception you threw on the opening drive, come back and throw another strike and gain nice yardage. And I give credit to two people on this one. The man throwing the ball and the person calling the plays. They're not shutting him down early in this game. Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Second down in the yard. They'll stay on the ground with Jacobs. And he is swallowed up right at the line of scrimmage. Not enough there for a first. No gain as a matter of fact. And it leaves them at third and one. Trying to run for it with Jacobs. And he picks up the first as he's able to take it down to the seven-yard line. Give them the third down conversion, five yards on the play. A chance for their first points of the season here as it's first and goal. Switching things up, they'll throw it now with Jordan Love. He's got Lewis. And they'll get this from the eight to the five. Pick up a three. I'm wondering if the same thing went through your mind as mine. When I see a big man like that make a catch, all I keep thinking to myself is, Big man with football. <laughs> Look out, everyone. He may not juke you a whole lot, right? He may not run past you because of his size. You're talking about a guy weighing in the 270 range. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Green Bay touchdown. So the 
football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. Off the play fake, Love. And an incomplete pass. That'll stop the clock here with just under a minute to play in half number one. That certainly appeared to be a play call where they were just trying to make second down, second and short. I think they thought the coverage was off a little bit more than it was. Nice job there pressing up on it and forcing the incompletion. Now this aired out deep for Reed. And that's going to be incomplete. Good effort there trying to take a shot, but it's third down. Well, they approached this drive with a lot of confidence after the last one ended up as a touchdown. But incompletions on their first two throws has them huddling up and trying to figure out a big play here on third down to get their momentum going again. And he's going to be stopped here a few... They'll have the football to start the third quarter. Play fake. Here's Love. He finds his man complete. It's Jacobs. And he'll be out of bounds across the 30-yard line. Here is third down and four. To pass. Here's Jordan Love. Forced out to his left. And he's going to have the Packers first down by about a yard. It's a gain of five on third and four. No surprise to see a sideline fired up by that big play. Heck, we're fired up, but we're supposed to be neutral. That's a quarterback putting his body on the line to fight and just barely get the first down. When he does something like that, he gets everyone ready to lay it all out there and try and match his intensity. So the completion results there in nine yards, and it'll bring up a second and short. Man, I just love being in this stadium. So much history, tradition, so many great teams and games, and we're seeing a pretty good one right now. Hotly contested in the third quarter. And he'll be brought down at the 48-yard line. 40 yards now on the ground on just seven carries. He had a ton of success here so far, but you get the feeling that he might be on the verge of popping one. Yeah, even on that one, there was a little bit of a hole, but it closed there quickly at the end. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. Fair to say, hasn't been his best game throwing the football, but also not getting a lot of help out there either. Yeah, you kind of you nailed it pretty well, you know. <laughs> He's got to throw it better. Got to get more help. Obviously one that should have been caught. They've got to find a way to bring those, those two elements together so they can make some progress in this one. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. We saw this a lot in the first half, and it continues. These receivers just not able to get much separation. So that means they have to win the 50-50 balls. They've got to go up with the defender and find a way to start coming down with them. And this time, contact and another incomplete pass. Got a man. It's caught inside the 10. It's a Packers touchdown. It's a tie game as we drop you back in and the offense gets set to take over. They'll begin on the ground with Jenkins. And he'll manage to pick up about four at second down. Well, we all know the guy carrying the ball is going to get the credit both in the stat line and probably in the newspaper. But guess what? Those guys creating holes, they couldn't feel better about themselves right now. Offensive line, tight end, probably even the wide receivers are involved. And he's going to be sacked. They sack him back right at the midfield strike. Andrew Billings able to collapse the pocket, get to him, and drop him for a loss of a yard. But found his way into the backfield, and he simply would not be denied. Well, they say that life's all about opportunities, and that holds true when you're playing defense as well. How about him seeing that chance, making the most of it, did a great job of wrapping him up. And bringing him down. And in this case, he's able to avoid the pressure and get out of there. He doesn't get the first down, but he does turn a possible loss into positive yardage. Now 
Now on fourth down, on is the punt team sending this one away. And this one hit. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And one of the things we like to hit on every year are the new rule changes. And we've got a few for 2023. A lot are procedural, having to do with deadlines and roster construction and such. But the two kind of caught my eye, Charles. One is the option to fair catch a kickoff and have it come out to the 25. Well, this is taken in. It's complete. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. 39 yards there, a big one. They absolutely had to take some chances downfield trailing here in the fourth quarter. So why not go four verticals, send the guys downfield, say make a play? And that's one of the favorite routes of offensive coordinators. You know why? Because receivers can be open at any point running that route. Buying time to his left. And he'll toss this one incomplete. Seeing no options, he throws it away. At this point in the second half, one mistake on a first throw could doom your chances of a comeback. So that's the right call there to just throw that one away. On second down, Love once more. Pressure and he's taken down. A big sack. Andrew Billings in there to get him once again. That's two sacks for him now here on opening day. Someone got going a little early. The crowd's not doing that old line any favors. Home field advantage is really kicking in, making it very difficult for them to hear the snap count. Here we go. This is fourth down. Now Love. He's going to let it fly. Oh, and that's going to sabotage their comeback plans. It is intercepted. Picked by Kevin Byer. And the Bears have just... Well, this was not just the opener of a brand new season, but this...